In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to link Confluence with Jira. This tutorial is especially useful for those who use both Atlassian products, as it allows for seamless integration, making project management more efficient. We'll walk through the process step by step to ensure that you can follow along and replicate the steps on your own system with ease. Start by navigating to your Jira dashboard. Once you're there, your first move will be to click on the settings icon, which can be found in the top left corner of the screen. This is where you'll manage all your administrative and product configurations. Selecting the correct settings area is crucial, as this will guide you to the subsequent steps for integration. After you've accessed the settings, you'll need to select the products option. This allows you to manage the different products and applications that are part of the Atlassian suite. This step ensures that the focus is on product integrations, which is exactly what we are looking to establish between Jira and Confluence. Next, under the integration section, you'll want to select application links. This is where you manage how Jira communicates with other applications, including Confluence. Application links will form the backbone of the integration, enabling the two platforms to exchange information seamlessly. Now click on Create Link. This action takes you to a page where you'll create a new connection. Creating a new link is essential as it establishes the path through which the two applications will communicate. When prompted, select Direct Application Link as the link type. This step is important because it specifies the nature of the connection you're aiming to establish. A direct application link implies a straightforward direct line of communication between Jira and Confluence. You'll then need to enter your Confluence URL. Make sure you type in the correct URL. If there are any typos, the connection won't be established correctly. So take a moment to double check your entry. After entering the URL, click Next. This will move you forward to the next phase of the setup where you will be guided through prompts that help confirm the connection. Following these prompts ensures that all required information is correctly provided, enabling a successful linkage. As part of the process, you will need to assign a name to your application. This could be anything that makes it easily identifiable, especially if you plan on having multiple integrations. A clear naming convention could save time in managing these links later on. Proceed by selecting Confluence as the application type. This ensures that the correct communication protocols are established and maintained. Finally, click on Continue. Completing this step finalizes the integration process, making the connection live. Once done, you'll have successfully linked Confluence with Jira, enabling you to leverage the power of integrated project management tools. I hope you found this guide helpful and that it makes your Atlassian experience even more productive. Thank you for watching, and don't hesitate to dive into these integration capabilities to enhance your workflow.